Hi everybody, coming to you with a quick um, affinity designer video. I was just going to show you a quick way to make a cubed text design. So let's get started. So first thing I'm going to do is make myself a background. So I'm just going to go with yellow and I'm going to lock that in. All right, and next I'm going to bring in some text i'm gonna go with the word dope all right and i'm just gonna duplicate it two times control j control j and i'm just gonna bring it down just gonna bring it down just aligning it a little bit there apply and let's see just want to bring this up just a wee little bit all right that's good for me all right and while I'm here I'm just gonna turn this into an SVG all right so I'm just gonna right click I'm gonna hit convert to curves and that groups it and I'm going to right click again and I'm going to ungroup and you can do this two ways you can just you can click add from right here or you can right click go to geometry and do add so that's two ways you can do it so just want to show you that all right so now I'm just gonna hit add and now it's one so all I'm gonna do now I'm just gonna make it a little bit smaller All right, and I'm going to duplicate two times, control J, control J. All right, and to achieve the cube design, I mean, this is super easy. Um, you're just going to use the uh, isometric tab. If you do not have it, which I do have it right here, um, you can find it in view and you go to studio. And then you would just go to isometric. If it was unchecked, then you would just check it and it would show up. And uh, I keep mine here. And when it comes in, it would, it might just come out just like this. And you can just, you know, you can leave it there. Um, but if not, you can just drop it back over here. And so I'll just bring it over here. All right, I'll just leave it there, move this over. All right, so um, all that I'm gonna do right now, I have my, first one on top here, I'm just gonna click that one, and I'm just gonna go click on top, and I'm gonna hit fit to plane. And I'm gonna go to the second one, and I'm gonna click on side, and I'm gonna click fit to plane. Go to the third one, and I'm gonna click on front, and then I'm going to click on fit to plane. All right. And now all I'm going to do is bring it together. And from here, you can, you can basically align it, you know, however you want. And I'm just bringing it up a little bit for myself. And you can figure out the spacing that you want but I'm just basically showing you uh, the technique on just how to achieve that okay so I mean you can type in whatever words you want and um, you know just group them together you can make it as an SVG if you want to you don't have to you can do this for sublimation I just was showing you basically trying to show you a couple things in one so it was just that simple like I said you go here up to view um, you go to studio you bring in isometric and you do top front and side and there you have it you put it together and whatever words you want to put in there you align them how you want to I just did it you know you know so it can look like this 
So there you have it. Um, if you have any questions, please be sure to leave it in the comments below and do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.